What's up? It's hot as shit outside. It's just humid. The dew point's too dang high, man. Yeah, shit sucks ass, bro. Fourth of July was good and shit, though. Thanks for everyone who came by on the fourth and bought shit that was way too cheap. It's in line for it. Shout out to y'all. Maybe we'll do more shit like that. I'm thinking about changing uh, how we do the online and like in-store stuff. So you may see a video about that soon. We haven't talked about food in a while. I'm getting super fat, so we should talk about food. We're gonna talk about ice cream. One of my favorites. Big ice cream guy. Uh, we got product and shit though. So we should probably just get into that and then we'll talk ice cream. And um, Nate really likes that rolled ice cream, which I think is kind of bizarre, but. The cold soap? No, the one they have over here in Chinatown. Where they like make it flat and then they roll it into like little sheets and then they put it in the cup. No, you don't. Seen that. Here's why you haven't seen that because your algorithm is all fucking Andrew Tate and there's no food re restaurant reviews on there. I got a big back fucking algorithm. Dog. Don't even. <laughs> I got a book. big back. Sorry, yes, I, I do. Know, I don't know why you're mad at me because I'm just constantly getting berated by a man that's just telling me to get richer and to get more hoes. Are you gonna start listening to him anytime soon? No. Okay. Supreme. <laughs> Supreme Popeye faded out. I got a dry clean because it was a little yellowed. It's a good one. We got Patchwork Rick Detroit skinnies. Yeah. You don't like those? <laughs> They're not for me. <laughs> we got some interesting footwear today. Prada America's Cup sold water shoes. Balenciaga inside out shirt. You're like, why is the tag out? It's because they designed it because they're so fucking avant-garde. And like, this is just like really subversive fashion. Like it's a metaphor for like society and shit. Supreme, true religion. Were you a true guy growing up? No, no, I was, I kind of like missed that mark. Yeah, I was a polo guy. I liked academics and shit. Got some sunglasses, some Mew Mews. These are cute. Stop, man. What? I edit that out. <laughs> it slipped out. <laughs> Chrome hearts, skull cap, Matty Boy joint. This probably looks cool on me, right? <laughs> nah? No. Supreme Miles Davis Nefertiti. I have this shirt. It's a good one. Rommel Z, old Supreme. LV, kind of like dad slides. Jesus joggers, Jerusalem cruisers. We got another pair of Hermes ones with the H. Those are for like a Greek dad. These are more for like the chic that is in the boat of the last scene of Taken. Thug Club, which is I think a Korean brand. You can always kind of tell by a brand's name that English isn't their first language, you know? Oh, Chrome Hearts. Little, you know, it could be for something if, if you got the girth, you know what I'm saying? Dude, please. <laughs> please stop. <laughs> with, the, with the LL beanie on, bro, you're getting freak bull vibes. <laughs> I'm a freak bull, bro. <laughs> MM6 boots, brand new. I think these probably glow in the dark, right? Yeah, I think they do. So when you're walking in the snow, people know you got Margiela on. I wouldn't commit a crime in these though. And then vintage Bjork hat. That's a little warm, but it's gonna be cheap. All right, so ice cream, amazing food, delicious. One of the best sweets, one of the best foods. Nutrient dense, you can't eat too much of it. It's hot, ice cream's good. We are talking about though, eating ice cream during the day, big back as fuck. That is the equivalent of like drinking Smirnoff during the day. Drinking Smirnoff during the day is to what alcoholism is as eating ice cream is, is to like obesity. I'm a soft serve guy. Nate was giving me shit cause he never heard a hard pack. That's an industry term for the ice cream that comes in like pints and shit. It's good, soft serve is better. Better texture, yummier. You can mix stuff in. I also like uh, frozen yogurt. Not the bullshit yogurt flavor, but like, you know, like cookies and cream, like a sweet one. But we were talking about this earlier as well. Frozen yogurt and soft serve are good. I like the ones where you can do your own toppings because really it's, it's a candy delivery device. It allows me to eat, again, a trick or treat's worth of candy without going to buy a bunch of candy and letting people in public see me buying a bag of candy, which is deeply embarrassing. Flavors, what are we, what are we talking about? I don't love chocolate ice cream. I'm gonna let it go. I love chocolate candy. I'll put chocolate candy on it, but vanilla ice cream is the best. I like a peanut butter ice cream. You know, like those type of flavors. I like a berry ice creamer a lot. Like a raspberry, blueberry, blackberry, marionberry, mulberry, moistenberry. Coffee ice cream. I like coffee ice cream, but I'm scared it's gonna keep me up. I don't want to eat it late and then have to stay up all night playing Elden Ring, getting frustrated. What are you like, you some absolute ice cream? I don't love like a sorbet, you know? So gelato, all that shit that's out? I don't fuck with gelato either. Gelato is like fine, it's just overly fancy, overly expensive regular ice cream. It's not like any better. I fuck with sherbet. Really? The long way rainbow? That and some fucking Sprite, making a little punch? As far as like ice cream brands, what do you stand on? You haagen -Dazs Yo, guy? Jenny's is gas. haagen -Dazs is ass, bro. haagen -Dazs is bullshit. Bottom of the barrel deli ice cream. Van Leeuwen's made, the best ice cream on earth is Morgan Stern's. 
the regular Morgenstern's over there on Houston and LaGuardia is the best ice cream I've ever had. The burnt honey vanilla is so fucking good. Yeah. It is like one of the best things I've ever eaten. They got all these freaky ass flavors. That shit is fucking gas. It's expensive, but like, whatever, who the fuck cares? Ben and Jerry's is kind of like the bare minimum, you know? I just feel like sometimes it's be doing too much. That's what I think the appeal is of, of Haagen-Dazs. It's just like, a completely minimal. Just get some fucking Briars then, bro. Briars is absolute trash, that's for trash food. Briars is trash. Leave that in. That's, that is a trash ice cream. I haven't had in a while. Any ice cream that comes in a larger format than a pint is probably bullshit. I fuck with a McFlurry the long way too. Or a Frosty. Frosties are absolute. Yeah, we should go to Wendy's, bro. We good? We can wrap this up? Much like my favorite ice cream, we got the coldest deals in the city, baby. How's that? <laughs>